Ice and yeah. put out something inflammatory or mix it around, you put your own copy right out next to it. In the days, this day of the internet, you can't get away with things like that anymore. It used to be you could just take that little snippet out and put it out. And so you don't, it you don't agree with that theory that it could be sliced and Oh, I think it could, but that I mean, goes both ways. You have your own copy of the tape. You have your own transcript. You have your own people here to say, no, that's not what happened. But when something goes out incorrectly, it's hard to change it. Yeah, once it hits the airwaves, then <laughs> it's Ma'am, ma'am, if so then we have no ma record, no if I was to put this on YouTube and slice yeah. and dice it and make you look silly, you have your own recording here. All you need to do is put the whole unedited footage up there. The real issue here is not what someone's going to do with the tape. The issue I would ask is, why is someone who holds a position afraid to say it in front of the family? In today's day and age, if you're going to have a public meeting in a public library and say this is an organization we want to support their agenda and promote it and, and get new members, that's fine. Well, maybe I don't he has care a what your opinion is, why won't you say it in front of him? Maybe he's afraid someone's going to come and shoot him or something. I don't know what his reason What's the camera are? got to do with that? There's, there's armed yeah. men standing in this room right now. Police but there was a police officer yeah, here. No, no, I'm that's saying irrelevant. not now, in the future, because he's lived, and people might see him and go decide to go after him or something. Ma'am, Bob, Bob Ricker is not a, a little-known private citizen. He's a well-known lobbyist. And again, <laughs> he's, been, he's testified in front of Congress before on C-SPAN. He has no problem being on TV. For fear that sometime in the future maybe someone will not like it. Okay? Again, let's go right back to the First Amendment. The First Amendment protects unpopular speech. Okay? That if everyone agreed with what was said, there'd be no real need for the First Amendment because everybody would be like, yeah, I agree. Ten Commandments. Woo! Thou shalt not kill. Nobody disagrees with that. Thou shalt not steal. Nobody disagrees with that. But when you have people like Larry Flint, who want to I'm just more confused than I ever was. That's protected under the First Amendment. It's very unpopular speech for the majority of Americans, but it's still protected by the First Amendment. As I said, this issue is to listen between individual rights and state rights, and we can agree and disagree all day long about that respectfully, but that debate needs to be held in the open. Not on the I did. I came to hear what was going to be said, not to interrupt your meeting and not to disrupt it. I just want to hear what you guys have to say. As much as I would love to have members of your organization play some part me, feel free to sit in the back. Feel free to sit in the front. You know, we are not afraid to have anyone. We both take our meeting. We don't want to give me. We take. We we delete out the audio where people identify themselves. But. Well, I personally I actually to so I I not say it where other people can hear it. Why not say it and put it up against the litmus test of lots of people being able to see it? And, um, you know, that's, that's what this is really about. I mean, if you have something to say that's so unpopular that you don't dare let anybody have a recording of it, okay, that's a legitimate concern, people. Cut, slice, and, and take out context all day long. We all understand that. That's what the news excels at. You take the same story and put it on two different uh, you know, networks. And there's the Daily Show does it very well. well. That's it. it most, everybody does it. We all understand that, which is why I think you need the unedited recording so people can make their own decisions. Well, enjoy your evening.